Hello, this is Ms. Calderon with a special presentation in honor of Dia de los Muertos month, the month of November. Good morning and good morning. I'm Ms. Calderon, the principal at Bridgepoint and Crossroads, and I want to take this opportunity to do a special introduction to a short video that I put together with one of our teachers, Ms. Shepard. Ms. Shepard and I both celebrate El Dia de los Muertos and El Dia de los Cinco. This is a tradition that is celebrated in many Latin American countries and has recently become popular here in the United States. Uh, we have been doing a Dia de los Altar for the past two years with the help of Ms. Smith. And um, it's been through some changes. You know, art class has helped us, uh, leadership has helped us, and it's definitely a celebration that we'd like to see grow on our campus. And it's something that we miss. For those of you who celebrated, we hope you had a wonderful holiday. Uh, November is considered the entire month is considered in celebration of Dia de los Muertos. So many of us keep our alfaras, alfaras or pandas up. Um, for the entire month of November, and some of us keep those up for the entirety of the year. I just want to share that I myself uh, suffered a loss this past year, a couple of losses this past year. Um, during the summer on my birthday, I lost my student, uh, Dante Sloan, you will see him in our video that we made. He passed away on my birthday of COVID-19, so please remember to continue to take care of your health wear your mask, maintain social distance, wash your hands, do all the things that you need to do to stay safe so that I don't have to miss you, or so your family doesn't have to miss you the way that we miss Dante this summer. I also lost my Abelita, my Um, She passed at the age of 102, so she lived a full, beautiful life. And while we miss her, we know that um, she's still with us. She is one of our antepasados, one of our ancestors. So we hope you like our short video. We hope that you participate with us next year if you're still at Bridgepoint or Crossroads. And we just wanted to wish you um, remembrance and honor of your loved ones. Thank you. So that was the introduction and now I'm going to share my screen so that you can see a short video that I put together with Miss Shepard. We were hoping to get more photos of your family and friends. We know that it's hard during this pandemic to do this kind of sharing, but we hope that we're able to do it um, in the near future. So I, if you'll bear with me, I'll share my screen again so you can see the video that was put together with uh, photos from Miss Shepard and myself. Sorry for the technical difficulties. I'll be right back. Thank you for your patience. Thank you so much for joining us for that special presentation. We hold all of your loved ones in our hearts. Gracias.